everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing very good. So in this video, I'm going to unbox a brush, makeup brush set from Pack Cosmetics. This is actually a gift. Uh, you know, I recently got married and by the way, that uh, reminds me that this is my new setup I'm, this is how I would be sh uh, shooting all my future videos and I finally got my tripod and I'm so happy to be shooting like before now come back to the point so when I got married my uh, best friends decided to give me this set of course you know a perfect gift for somebody who loves makeup um, I never got a uh, time to play around with it and I finally decided it's time to open this beauty but uh, I thought that why not just you know do an unboxing of this set with you guys and if you are a makeup enthusiast as well you can probably you know give this a try this is 8000 rupees worth set and it has practically everything that you uh, you need to do your own makeup or your friends and your families so um without any further ado let's get started but before that please do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell next to it so that you're notified each and every time the space is on youtube and now let's get started <laughs> all right so this is the outer packaging uh, it's a simple cardboard box with the this standard black packaging and the uh, back side basically explain other products uh, when you open this there's a flap like this which is attached with tape so for that remove that and then inside, there's this makeup pouch, uh, which basically has all your, um, not makeup, brush pouch basically, that has all the makeup brushes inside. Uh, why I love this? Because, uh, you know, it's very easy to organize your brushes and it's very easy to carry them while you're traveling. I always, uh, you know, lose my brushes or don't find the ones that I want while I'm traveling and it's always a panicky situation. So yeah, I'm really happy to have this. And I remember when I started doing makeup, um, I wanted to get this set, but it was a little expensive for me at that time and I didn't get it. So it kind of has a sentimental value as well for me, but so glad that I finally have it in my kit. So anyway, uh, this is how the pouch is. It's a basic simple pouch, but, and here's the zip basically. So you open it and so basically there are four yeah four major sections which has five or six individual sections and has different brushes I'll explain all the brushes one by one um, but before that let me just quickly mention that uh, Pack Cosmetics is a cruelty free brand so none of these brushes are extracted or no, basically nothing for these brushes are used from animals the hair are synthetic hair and the overall packaging is also cruelty free so big thumbs up for that uh, now I'm just going to show you all the brushes one by one so let's get started so honestly I think even I don't know all the brushes but I'll do my best to explain okay so the first one is this flat top brush which looks somewhat like this you see that and this is great for foundation application honestly for me brushes don't have any rules I use any brush for anything whatever suits my purpose uh, but I'm just going to try to explain you as professionally as possible as much as I know so this one is basically for um, you know foundation but you can use this for your uh, blush as well uh, and this these are the bristles are really really soft and it's a very dense brush so I cannot wait to use them on my face damn so the next one is my favorite brush uh, I love contouring my face especially my cheeks I don't know why I just love that part of makeup uh, this one is a slightly angled and tapered brush if you can see that and it's perfect for cheeks jawline uh, basically you know giving your face that shape and the crispness this is a perfect brush again very dense very soft and then we have a slightly smaller uh, flat top brush I think this can also be used for you know contouring basically bronzing because this is slightly fatter than the earlier one uh, but this is great for that uh, and again of course you can use this for um, blush you can use this for your under eyes you, when you have to set your under eyes basically and uh, the next one uh, is a simple fluffy brush I, I'm pretty sure this one is actually for blush and stuff like that uh, because the size is perfect for that and again very soft very dense 
then um, this one is uh, basically a powder brush it's, it's a smaller powder brush again great to set your under eyes and uh, you know you can do other stuff as well I'm probably going to use this for my highlight as well because I think it's, it's just gonna pick the perfect amount and then spread it away nicely so yeah uh, and the next is an even, even smaller powder brush I think this would be great to do your concealer slightly bigger for that but yeah it's for setting your under eyes or doing anything that's you know that needs a slightly precision on your face not on your eyes but yeah looks like a great brush now I'm going to show you some of the eye brushes the first one is my all time favorite angled brush I love these because you can create so many simple looks but still uh, you know have that uh, edge to the look uh, with this single brush so um, this one is how the angled brush looks like it's it's a slightly uh, wider brush and uh, it, it's very crisp actually to be honest so I think it's, it's a little bit great to fill in your eyebrows to do a wing liner or yeah I think <laughs> that's pretty much about it oh wow this is the flat uh, brush that basically you know helps putting picking up pigments really well and then you know just application of pigments come really well through these brushes of course you'll see me using these brushes in my videos and you will know how i feel about them one by one this is just an unboxing and just kind of you know how i uh, like the feel and the touch of the brushes okay i have used a couple of brushes from pack in the past and i've loved them so i have a very high hope from these uh, brushes as well uh, and i'm kind of sure i'm gonna love them but anyway uh now this one is uh, basically a blending brush i love these kind of brushes perfect size this helps you get the precision uh blends the product really really well and i i love using this uh, as you know to put deep dense shades in my crease and the outer corner i think they blend in really beautifully with these kind of brushes and uh, then we have a slightly flatter and a fluffier brush so basically flat brush or fluffy brush blending brush get beach ka combination hai. so it's kind of like this again i love it to blend this side of my like you know the crease i i just feel it blends in really beautifully and uh, i have something similar for from real techniques one of my first few uh, brush purchases and I've st I'm still using that really good brush for amazing um, you know blending and then we have a smaller angled eye brush which is like this great for eyeliners crisp liners and then we have a flat brush this is not angled this is flat straight line brush uh, this is great for lower lash line i love using these kind of brushes to just apply deep dense colors to the lash line and you know then blend it with something else uh, so basically this smooth clear transition so now moving on to the next section of brushes we have some more uh, eye brushes we'll continue talking about them so this one is again a blending brush slightly smaller than the last one that we saw uh, again great for precision great for blending the outer corners and the crease love the stuff and it's very dense i cannot wait to play play with these and i'm so sorry i've been repeating the same line again and again now this one is a smaller flat uh, or dense brush here each combination i'm so sorry i don't know what what they call it but again a great brush to uh, blend in you know if you're playing with a lot of colors in your crease i think these brushes are really going to help you like you go from that lighter to darker to the denser shades and then you you know just to blend all of that together i think these brushes are really going to help you i can already imagine myself uh, you know doing a particular look with these I cannot wait to show you uh this one is a proper blending brush it's a fluffy big blender uh great for everything basically I just love blending brushes and I use them for everything on my eyes basically so yeah uh, then we have this kind of brush I don't know exactly what to call it but uh, you know I, I, I use them for different things to pick up pigments to apply on my lower lash line I've used these for different uh, you know uh, purposes if you know the exact use of this brush do let me know because I am unaware about that um, the next one is just a smaller version of the last brush that we saw 
again i think this will be great for inner corners i uh, i already have a purpose for this one now the next next one is actually a lip brush or an eyeliner brush i think lip brushes and eyeliner brushes are pretty much the same it's not coming out but anyway so it really helps to get that amazing uh, you know wing liner and precision on your lips although i never really use a lip brush but i definitely want to use this for my um wing liner and uh, the next is basically a spoolie oh my god how much i love spoolies i cannot tell you um i love doing my brows even though i have such thick full <laughs> eyebrows i still like doing them and sometimes i overdo and you guys you know like you tell me this is the old one <laughs> but theek hai i love doing them and i love a spoolie a nice spoolie is everything you know what i'm just going to try this actually i just know if i'm going to like a spoolie or not and i like this this is very crisp very nice and i i feel it brushing through the hair of eyebrows as well this is a great brush um we I left with the last six brushes so let's just quickly wind this up. Uh this is one uh, I don't know what exactly they use this for. I think this is for eyelashes or eyebrows. If you know please do let me know because um it's a two way process. I tell you something you tell me something and we both learn in the process. So yeah, this is the brush. It has a slight comb here. This thing I've never used this kind of a brush. Never really felt the need. Uh moving on we have this kind of brush um it's a very big blending brush um uh, in simple terms uh, but i think it will be great for under eye concealing i think it will give a lot of precision and uh, it can go inside you know, closer to your inner corners basically and then we have another blending brush this is definitely a blending brush you know you can never have enough blending brushes because those are the most used ones and whenever you're playing around with a lot of colors you do need a couple of them handy because whenever you're playing with darker shades um it kind of can you know it can get messy and uh, you might need to go in with the lighter shade and once you've used the same brush because that has happened to me i tend to use the same blending brush over and over again uh, for different colors and my technique is to go from lighter to darker uh but at times you do go wrong and you need to switch back to the lighter shade and uh, you always need a few spare blending brushes anyway uh this one is a small uh flat brush for this is basically for your foundation application uh concealer application in this case because this one is smaller we have a bigger variant of it as well this is a proper foundation brush which basically to spread the foundation and then you can go in with your blender if you like that or you can use one of the flat top brushes that I showed showed you in the past or um, you can also use a kabuki brush which is not in this set um i i have i guess shown you kabuki brushes in a couple of my makeup tutorials i don't remember but i uh, will show you in the future for sure now this one seems like it's going to be my favorite brush because this is the perfect powder brush that you can have in your kit um wow. i think this will be great for setting everything in place and for the blush as well oh, i i just i'm just loving doing this thank god i washed my hands before shooting the video uh yeah so that was the last brush uh i hope you enjoyed this video and i loved unboxing this it, it's it has kind of inspired me to start doing makeup looks um anyway uh that's all for this video it's a wrap now if you have some specific requests for me please do uh, let me know because my mind is kind of all over the place and uh and just kind of finding inspiration to shoot videos and new topics that really really interest me and push me forward so if you have something in your mind do let me know and i would love to shoot although i have a couple of videos planned and i am going to dedicate to shoot now but still i need a little push from you guys and uh, before i sign off please subscribe and hit the bell button follow me on instagram i do keep sharing a lot of stuff there i'll see you guys soon till then bye bye take care i love you so much Mwah.